Tonight, I-85 remains closed after a violent accident between two big rigs. At least one person remains in the hospital at this hour. Check out this video of the scene from earlier. It happened around 3 this afternoon. The wreck sending a plume of black smoke into the air. WCNC Charlotte's Anna King went to that scene as emergency crews worked to put out the fire and help the drivers of the two semis. I'm very proud of all the emergency responders that uh, that responded to the scene. Multiple crews jumping into action. Officials got the call at 3 p.m. of an accident along I-85 involving two tractor trailers. With two trailers split, smoke and fire, officials had to work quickly. Just so many uh, agencies that were actually here, uh, but the local fire departments did uh, an amazing job of doing the fire suppression and, and keeping the fire from hitting more of the wood line. All lanes along I-85 South near the South Carolina state line and I-95 North near Rocky Mount were immediately closed and drivers detoured. And officials say those lanes will be closed going into the night. In Gaston County, Anna King, WCNC Charlotte. And we are just learning that lanes should be open by midnight tonight. First responders say they are waiting to speak to relatives before releasing the idea of those involved and before disclosing how many people actually had to be transported.